British administration. The civilization of India was centralized by the government efficiency that was made possible by the British rule. This was a British policy in India towards self-government which made it certain that the British rule would be an enduring aspect of Indian life. The rule of law was the sphere of law that influenced Britain to unify India. Second, Britain was given too much credit for the law and order of India. Third, this was the rule of law which binds the government as a subject to justify its actions in the courts which was a typical British contribution to India. For a short period of time, the East India Company tried to place itself above the law by claiming that its officers would be outside jurisdiction of the Supreme Court. The rule of law before the 19th century led to the enjoyment by Indians of a remarkable degree of personal liberty. During the British bureaucracy, freedom of speech was the main force used to abuse the government and to ventilate a grievance that was equality before the law. This idea was brought about by the Hindu and the insistence of the British courts on dealing with a Brahmin and an outcast resented by Hindus. As soon as the British got behind company policy over India seriously, the East India Company had to rebuild the administrative and judicial companies. In the 20th century, more specialized services were established. The Public Works Department, the Indian Police, the Indian Forest Service and the Indian Medical Service undertook the process of converting India into a modern state.